got the old power wagon out today. I'm gonna try it out and see how she does. I haven't been down to the lake much lately. Water was up high, so water's coming down. We're getting our crawling spots back. And we're finding out that time has made it a little bit harder to make it up this stuff. So this is my good old class one slash three ring. Class one size tires and everything, but I've got dig on it. I know. I'm a horrible person. But you know what? I like it. Let's try a different angle. This is not working out at all. Had a lot of trouble. The cross made it up this. So I was really surprised that this one wasn't wanting to get it. Because I feel like this one is probably a little bit better at crawling than the cross. And this is the line that I believe I took with the cross. And rejected. Right here, you'll see the power wagon in its natural habitat. Running over weeds. And this climb is always pretty cool to try to pull off. And so close. use some horsepower trying to get those hyraxes to hook up but they're just not having it figure this would be a good spot to use that dig the outlaw that I am. And fail! There. That's how you use the dig. <laughs> These Hyrax Predators, they really hook up well. And the Hobby Wing system does great. So this is where we had the cross the other day. And then I knew that this rig, I was like, this rig's got to have it. Same line, carrying the front over that little ledge, but it sets itself back down. The back tries to walk, but it's got enough grip that it just keeps on, keeps on pulling itself up. Made it look easy. When you get the gom over there next. So this day there was a fire out somewhere. So out out in the distance it's just kind of a haze. No idea where the fire was. You could smell it. But you just see the haze over the lake from the fire. And this is always a nice little to go through this this is actually all one long section right here this is the other part of it this is all washing away they used to have a little bit of a bigger ledge that you could drive on here now you gotta put that driver's side a little bit up more on the edge of the wall there. I 
High racks and hobby wing. Great combination. And this truck's a little loud also. It's got a 3D printed gear for the spur gear also. And I've tried to quieten it down, but if you make it really tight, it kind of quiets it down. But if you make it the, the tightness it's supposed to be for your spur and pinion, it just, it's just loud. But I like having a bigger spur gear, give a little more torque. And right here, this is why good insurance is what you need. <laughs> the old body, I need more careful with it, they don't make it anymore. The old axial power wagon body. 